come take a shower with me. Something I've never said on video, or have I ever asked my daughter to come film me taking a shower? But hi, uh, Melissa Brown here. I want to talk to you guys about our hair care system, True Science NRF2 activated hair care system. And my shower sucks. It's either very hot or very cold. So, um, okay, I want to talk to you guys about this. I've never done a live in the shower report. So, do you want your hair to grow better? Do you want less breakage? Do you want your hair to be smoother? Do you want less chemicals in your life? Do you want this? Okay, this is how I do it. I part my hair in the middle because as you can tell, I have very thick hair. Now, you only need a little bit. When I store these, store the shampoo upright because it can leak out the top, but store your conditioner upside down so that it doesn't, um, so it comes up easy, okay? So we're just gonna put a tiny, I mean, tiny. Sometimes when people look at the price of this, they get a little concerned. But I'm telling you, this hair, it's like day five since I've washed my hair, okay? When you have clean products, you don't need to wash your hair so often. When you're using um, the crappy stuff, it's pulling all the oil out of your hair, out of your scalp, and that's why you have like the super shiny, no oil kind of stuff, right? But your body then needs to replenish those oils and it pumps the oils out of your head faster than necessary. So I put a little dab in here, I put it in my hands like that, and then, I go down the middle. Now, the first time, there's like no lather, right? There's, um, it doesn't look like I'm, it doesn't feel like I'm shampooing, it doesn't really look like I'm shampooing, but I'll tell you, for the first two years I used the shampoo, that's how I did it, okay? But I found out something recently, so I'm just getting that all the way through my scalp, getting all the, the dirt and the oils, and then I kind of just squeeze it through my the long parts of my hair. But here's a cool thing I learned recently. A soap molecule, it attaches to the dirt. And then, the, when you wash it again, that soap molecule attaches to itself. It's gonna create the suds, and it's gonna come off, and you're gonna be blown away. So I tell people all the time to do this, but not many of you. Like kids. You tell them, so I wanted to show you, so you will leave me a little bit more. Okay, so I'm just going through my hair, getting all that off. Now we're just gonna do it again, okay? I would see on these bottles, again, a tiny bit, okay? I mean, a, a tiny bit. I rub it through my hands, watch this. See the lather? Is it showing up for you? Yep, a lot. That is what happens the second time you use that shampoo. So then you rub that through everywhere because you want that squeaky clean. You want all the soap residue out of your hair. So the second wash, again, this lasts forever because you don't need to wash as often. Twice a week, I'm telling you, twice a week. And then, you only need a tiny bit, even if you have a ton of hair. Okay, so I just squeeze it out, soap, flour, and now I rinse. Okay, get it all out. One of my, you know, we're an activation company, and we mainly talk about cell activation and turning on that NRF2 pathway and helping your body to heal itself. I'll tell you one of my favorite stories, and it just reminded me standing there with my eyes closed forever with you guys on here, it is one of my gals with MS, and I really caused her, so I'm just squirting sun in here, um, balance issues. And when she got on our products, She's like, I can take a shower with my eyes closed now before she can do that. And I love Leslie and thank you for sharing that story with me. Okay, so now I just rub it around both hands. And for me, this goes in your scalp. 
but also goes everywhere. So you can use this as a leave-in conditioner. I know people of all sorts of different ethnicities that have loved this conditioner and shampoo. Um, I don't brush my hair, so like very ra rarely do I brush my hair. This is how I brush my hair. I put my conditioner in and then I start finger combing through it. Um, I have kind of wavy hair and now as I've had gray hair, it's just it's gotten coarser and more gray and all that stuff. Good people on my good questions. Sandra River, she said, <laughs> I was wondering if you washed your hair every day because it never looks greasy. I don't wash my hair every day, but it always it's always greasy. It used to never be. Yeah, it's because it's the cheap shampoos. Um, it's amazing, like, have you heard about Pantene? It's like, it was, it uses the same ingredients as floor wax. So it gives you that look initially, but long term it's not good for you. Like so many things we talk about over here in this, on this page. So yeah, that's how I condition my hair, that's how I brush my hair. I just do that, and then usually I don't wear a swimsuit, and this is when I wash myself. I just let it soak in, and then I go ahead and rinse, and then we're done for the day. But again, you can use this as a leave-in conditioner. Uh, before we had um, body lotion, the, all the different skincare things we have now, um, I know people that were using our conditioner as lotion because they want it clean. Have you ever seen the, um, oh, that, you don't need to see my fall of hair, because we all lose hair, but we shouldn't be losing clumps of hair, right? Like, you shouldn't pull out clumps of hair. There's something wrong going on in your system, and we, I'd love to work with you on that, if that's the case. But, um, the app called Think Dirty. So, you can download it to your phone, you can scan your favorite Bath & Bot beauty products, and it'll tell you, it'll rate them from a zero to a 10 on how um, toxic they are for you, right? So our products all go between a zero and a two, which is super, super, super clean. So not only are you not getting the toxins, the parabens, all that garbage into your scalp, your skin is your largest organ. This, think about how much stuff soaks into you from your hair. Do you have another question? Uh, yeah, Sandra said, I don't use Pantene, but yeah, I buy the cheap stuff. What does it smell like? Oh, okay, that's, so... Best smell ever. Ow. Best smell ever? Yeah, it's like peppermint, kind of. Yeah. It smells, it's like a kind of, it's like a light minty scent, but it's really nice. Yeah, it is a peppermint, um, I can't see it that well, sorry. <laughs> but it definitely has that peppermint-y, um, no, and it, it, it's peppermint essential oils, I believe, that are in this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, like right now, I do feel a little bit of tingling on my scalp because I've left that conditioner on for a long time. Now, there is also a hair serum. So, I personally don't use the hair serum, but if you're like Joy, Joy, oh, wait, we can turn that. There we go. Um, so, Joy just got really sunburned. Okay, she went to the Dominican Republic and she toasted. So we're gonna be putting on our NRF2 anti-aging cream on all that. It's gonna help her sunburn tremendously. But we're also gonna put that hair serum. So our hair serum and our eye serum have the highest concentration of NRF2. And we're gonna put that hair serum down her burnt scalp so it helps clean up that the dandruff. It's not good, but it's, you know, she has sunburn. If you're struggling with hair loss, if you're struggling with I mean, I've seen people with cradle cap. If you've got some hair issues going on, you're going to take that hair serum and you're going to do a line here, a line here, and a line straight down the middle. And then you just massage that in. So, uh, I'm wondering how he uses that every time. <laughs> he does not want to struggle with hair loss. Um, and so, if you're, if you're looking for that, check it out. If you go into this page, search up hair care. Look like just type in the you know it has a little magnifying glass within the group and look up hair care and your mind will be blown. This was introduced about two and a half years ago. I'll tell you I wasn't excited about it because I was addicted. I had seen so many people get their life back on our products. I'd see over and over energy back, like feeling great. And I wanted those testimonies. I really wanted to do that. And so when they had shampoo, I was like, 
I want to sell shampoo. Like that. I'm not here for that. Like I prided myself on like never wearing makeup and being really like hippy dippy natural and not being prideful and a lot of things, you know, whatever. I was being prideful. <laughs> but um so when I started seeing the shampoo, I was not happy until I started seeing the testimonies. This girl, the very first girl that tried this, she basically had a reverse mohawk. She basically had a reverse mohawk. And she was 23, 25, something like that. She didn't go outside anymore because of what was going on and how bare she was to walk out in public. She got on our hair care system. That cleared up for her within a couple of months. She was able to live her life again with true confidence. That is so encouraging to me. So now when we're sharing like the collagen and these different things, yes, collagen helps your joints, helps with so many things, but also the outward. We want to put our best face forward all the time, right? And you want to go out and not feel like you have to wear a ton of makeup or you have to wear a hat or a wig or something to be confident. And so I love sharing these products. It's been really fun to watch um, people have great results and even just to lessen the toxic load on your system. Whenever we can do that, let's do it. All right, well, I'm gonna take my swimsuit off and wash myself <laughs> now. And we're not gonna be on camera. So you guys have a great day. If you have any questions about hair care, ask. Um, we're gonna have this in, gu in the guides, in the guide section. Everybody's been doing so many videos. You can go check that out. If you want to know about any product we have, there's going to be somebody talking about it. And there's so many testimonies in this group too. So make sure you're using that search magnifying glass. Look up the stuff you care about. You will find we don't have many disease names in this group because it's an FDA thing. We're herbal products or herbal company. We're not supposed to say disease names. We talk about quality of life. So that it can be a little more challenging on the search. I know we all want to like look up that one thing, but we can't. So um, message me if you have questions. We're here to help. Have a great day. Thanks, Joy, for your help.